Well, we'll have a nice little cup of tea first. Come in the kitchen. It's cosy in there. Well, this is the stuff for you, Muriel. You don't mind if I call you Muriel, do you? No. No. Should try it now, then. Start your breathing, then. Breathe quite deeply. Breathe. Breathe. It smells a bit funny, Mr. Christie. Yes. Do you feel a bit dizzy? I do a bit. Yes, well, that's all the goodness taking effect. We had a lot to do with medical stuff then. Consulting. I'm always on hand for advice, Beryl. If you... Oster, I was browsing through some of my uh, medical texts before you came in. As a matter of fact, perhaps you'd like to... Uh... Well, I, uh, I don't know about all, all this stuff, see? No, no, no. I won't conceal the dangers from your mind, uh, the, um, uh, the, uh, stuff uh, I, I use. Uh, one in ten might die from it. What's the matter? Say on your soul. Amen. through my papers, cuttings and things, newspaper cuttings. I was in all the papers a few years back. <laughs> Murder trial it was. Dreadful business, appalling. Of course, I was in the police once, so I understand these things. I have had a very Varied life. Only really. In all the papers a few years back and now. Pig. Well, of course, if that's the way you're going to talk. It's what I'd expect, of course. What are you doing? Looking for work? 
my employment cards haven't come through. Well, what's your name? John Waddington. Have you got anything on you to prove your identity? No, nothing at all. Take your hat off, will you? You're Christie. John Reginald Christie. I shall have to take you into custody. Come along.